never recover. What's going on, YouTube? Welcome back to Pokemon Ultimate Center Ultimate. Ultimate, 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 Ultimate. In the last episode, we took on the Aether Foundation and officially, well, we didn't officially beat Lucy. I mean, we beat her for the first time and we sent her to the. Uh, well, she went into her dimension that she created by stressing out Cosmo Cosmog, and that's about it. So, uh, pretty cool stuff. We're just going to get going here. The team hasn't changed any. i got to switch up the order, though, so I have my lower-level Pokemon on front so they can get the XP immediately. But we have to go to Pony Island now, so we have to meet Gladian down at the docks. Oh, I didn't even realize this guy gave me the Farfetch the stick. That's cool. But that, I think, like, doubles the power of, of Farfetch's moves. I didn't get a chance to... Fucking damn it! <laughs> I didn't get a chance to talk to these people because they weren't here. So, I want to talk to people and see if anyone gives me stuff here. Oh, there you guys are. Alright, no one down there gives us anything, so we're going to go now. <clears throat> Ready to go? Yes. Alright. Let's go, Lily. No holding back. Okay. We are headed to Pony Island, the last island of the game. And of course, I will change up the team if I find something interesting enough to change the team with. You will, You guys can also give me ideas on what you would like to see me use. And actually, feedback. I don't think they added anything to the Seafolk Village. Damn it! Da-da-da! <laughs> Pony Island. Almost no one lives on it. You find a whole lot of nature to explore here. Go find the Kahuna. The Kahuna of Pony Island also protects the altar where Alola's people worship the legendary Pokemon. Maybe they'll know something might help you. Gladian, thank you for this. I'm glad you finally. I finally know what you left and you were trying to help mother and father. If you just told me that back then. I'm sorry. All I could think about these is how no and I had to be stronger. But we'll use the strength we found to protect the foundation of Mother's Place. This will be your battle now. I know you can handle it. Oh my god, Zeppy story. That actually means absolutely nothing. It's basically just a fancy way. He's taking control of the the, a the Aether Paradise and she's gone with me. Okay, I'm okay. You, you know what you have to do now. Maybe it sounds strange. I'm kind of excited. Oh, it's Mina! Oh my goodness! Instead of the... The veteran dude from last time, it's Mina. I'm sorry, who are you? Like, dude, I'm Mina. I'm the local captain. Captain Mina, it's nice to meet you then. So let's get right down to things, dude. Which one of you is here for my trial? No, that's not why we're here. Well, I am. I mean, you're not entirely wrong. It's true that Lily's in the middle of her island challenge, but we're going to meet the Kahuna of the island. The Kahuna? Oh, that's a problem. Maybe she talked to Hapu? Oh, so Hapu lives here on Pony Island. Thank you very much, Captain Mina. Let's go, Lily. I'll be happy. I'll be good to see Hapu and Mudsdale again. Wonder what her trial is, because obviously that's one of the things I heard. Is that Z Noodles? What? Okay, I believe it's the person here. If you if you bring them in a Lolan Raichu, they'll give you the Raichium. Oh, oh. Brown up her. A lucky person? No. Really went over your luck inside. A lucky bunch. Okay. Hey, you kid. Do you know Pokemon Raichu looks a bit different? Uh, does it? I'm gonna say does it. Just, I know you're blown away, aren't you? I haven't gotten a chance to see one. I'll give you something good. I have him in my party. That's a Raichu. It said the Ra Raichu inside Johto are real fine, but this is a Lolan Raichu. It's fantastic. I like normal Raichu better, but uh, having a psychic type Pokemon is pretty cool. I'll give you some good, just like I said I would. I'll. A low right GMZ. Okay. Alright, so what uh, item or what move do I need to have? Thunderbolt! Beautiful. I can't remember what the name of it is. Wait, when did I get the dome fossil? Oh, from uh, Pokebelago. <laughs> now, from what I remember, this is the only place you could catch Delmize in the game. So I'm gonna stand back here and not move because, in case this is actually like a Delmize. I'd like to catch one, because I never got to use one. I really wanted to, but I never ended up... Hey, and there we go, first try. Not bad. Um, I, I'm debating I might switch to Sidueye for it, just because Delmize is a Pokemon I haven't ever used. I mean, same with uh, 
What's his name? But you'll be seeing something in the Wonder Widlock. So he'll get used plenty there. He did not want to stay in that quick ball. But this technically also gives me Steel Stab because of the uh, Steel Worker ability, which is a really cool ability. I know Dusk Ball has the effect of a Pokeball in normal, but I feel like it just suits Delmize really nicely. Damn it! Alright, please stay in the ball, Delmize. Alright, I'm going out into Sidueye. Oh, because of Wrap, I can't be switched out. Damn it. Gyro Ball. Okay, freed from Wrap. Good. Send in to Sidueye so you cannot Wrap me. Critical Capture. Again, what's the point of a Critical Capture if it doesn't stay in? Like, legitimately. <laughs> I'm really, like... I... I shouldn't have sent Bubbles out so he doesn't get wrapped. But the point is, uh... I was, I'm really debating on using Waterfall. I was gonna say it, it's stabbed, though. I don't want to do that. I really don't want to knock out those Delmize, because... You maybe can only catch Delmize here. And I'm... Uh, worried for no reason. Dude, okay, come on. What is your freaking catch rate? This is absurd. 25. So 3.3% to catch it from full health with a Pokeball. Screw it. Actually stay in this ball, though. Okay, screw it. I'm, I'm going for it. I'm gonna go for the, the, uh, waterfall. Bubbles levels up, but that's stupid. That's, that really does suck, though. But we got Flash Cannon, so that's pretty cool. I don't know who can learn it. Pikachu might be able to, which might be cool. I should have gone into Java and used Bulldoze. That would have been a good idea. I don't know why I had five nuggets, but I did. This guy sells Combine, Blizzard, Hype Beam, Solar Beam, Thunder, Sludge Wave. Ooh. Got some good TMs here. Worth spending my money on. I didn't realize Giga Impact was a TM. Ooh! I can teach Tenzin Stone Edge and I can use Lycanium Z and see what the actual move is like. Sweet! And I have like a PP Max for it too, so I'll give it that. So I don't really know if Delmize is a rare encounter, and I'm not gonna go back and check, because that irritated me that it didn't get ca caught. But it's okay. I'm gonna use my shiny decidua anyway. Do you want to shell us? I want a gramble. Do I got a gramble? I don't think it has a gramble. Have I already said how much this music reminds me of Super Mystery Dungeon? Well, I'll get a gramble. Uh, and I'll trade you. I don't really know why you want to gramble for Shellos, but that's whatever. That's not my business. Do my best to keep up. I don't care. Just catch a Pokemon. It's not that hard. I promise. All right, let's go down to the beach. <laughs> Hurley Grimsley is really good at Mantine surfing. Alright. But I'm gonna do a ride back to Ula Ula, I think, just for the hell of it. What's funny is, based on how the islands actually are, um, I feel like that Akala is actually closer than Mele Mele is, but you can't go to Akala from here. There's so many obstacles, dude. Whoa! That's really cool. Three torpedo, man. That's not even fair. I can't. I literally cannot get a jump off. There's weight. Like, there's too many obstacles, and it's literally not even fair. You cannot control yourself that well to avoid everything. I haven't gotten one trick off. How did I hit the tentacle out of everything? 
There's another Waylord. And the game is lagging, that doesn't help. I do my best to avoid the things, but then I hit it anyway, and I lose all of my speed that I built up. Damn it. If I got the landing bonus, that would have been awesome. There's literally five Sharpedo. Yo, that is stupid. There's too many obstacles, legitimately, for this one. I don't know if that's just because we're on Pony, and just because it's the last island, they want to make it more difficult for some reason. I need to figure out what the combination for that Gyarados thing is. Come on, I should have landed that. Man, this was a terrible run. This isn't as bad as my first ever run, but this one's terrible. Well, 15,000. I mean, that's a su it's a super long course, too. That's new high score for you, everyone's psyched for you here, your beach points. Four beach points. Okay, I need to see... Whatever, don't you forget the right whatever. I don't care. I want to check the leaderboards. Wow, the number one here on the Ula, Ula spot is 43,000. That's crazy. Dude, like, literally, I'm not even joking, too. When I'm in the air, the, the hits to the right and left when I'm trying to spin, they sometimes just do not even register. So it's a couple slow spins, even when I was at orange. Yeah, let's do this. Why did it spin again to the left? I didn't go to the left once that entire trick. 11,000, that was awful. Try getting a bit higher up on the wave and try to catch some real air. It's hard to do when you're literally getting chased down by Sharpedo. It's kind of dumb that there's no place to spend your, your points. On that island. What's up, dude? But a team will try, yeah! Okay. Sure. If I get the chance to, I'll use, uh, whatever the, whatever right choose. I cannot remember what it is. It's like a, I don't remember. But, Tropius. And who do I have out front? Java. Alright, perfect. Level 45? Uh, I, why do I keep getting under leveled? Imagine he has a power herb. I, I'm guessing Solar Beam is the TM he bought. Because you can get Solar Beam at the... At the Pokemon. We know, because I just literally bought a bunch of them. I don't know if I bought Solar Beam or not. And Java gets to level 43. And Lilligant. They're both going to use Solar... Uh, whatever it is. Yep. And there goes Lilligant. I had the perfect Pokemon out front. That's awesome. Sweet. I didn't get to try it out enough. Well, you used it once per Pokemon, but both Pokemon died to two Fire Fang. If I'd said it, I'd probably be able to use Silver Beam in one. But you would have wasted a turn, and I still would have killed your Tropius in two turns. Anyway, we're going to put Paralyzed Axe up front. Oh, there's a Kerbaler. Is it actually going to be Kerbaler, or is it going to be uh, the, its evolution? It's still Kerbaler. I think I asked that when I was here last time. You know what? Stoked Spark Surfer. Alright, let's do it, Paralyzed Hex. That's a dope Z move. Oh my gosh, that's like right up there for me with 10 million Volt Thunderbolt. That's a really good animation. I'll have to get a Pikachu with Volt Tackle. And, um, I believe, I was gonna say, I think I have a physical Pikachu, but that was a Pikachu I had in Omega Ruby, and it was a, um, or Alpha Sapphire, one of the two, and it was a, uh, the Luchador, uh, Pikachu, but it wouldn't let me put it into Pokebank. I'll see if maybe it'll allow me to now, but anyway, we'll put Tenzin up front. We'll put Tenzin and Paralyzed Hacks up front, because why not? And we're going to go fight these two here. And we'll probably use Lycanium Z if I can, or if it's useful. I'm offering up my dancing appreciation for seeing grace. Apparently use the hula as part of a karate moose. Capoeira ca couple. Capoeira, I don't remember how to say that. Mianfu. So, 
Lycanium Z will not be helpful. This should probably one-shot the Mianfu. Yeah. That, that was a good call. Alright, there we go. Good job, you two. I really like Alolan Raichu. I really do. It's such a cool typing. Electric Psychic. It's the first one. I was hoping they make a Rotom form that ended up being, uh... Electric Psychic thing. I want. I wanted to, like to make the the to make the Rotom Dex a an actual Rotom form, because that would have been really cool. It's supposed to be able to see some. It's just an expanse of ocean. Actually, if I remember correctly, you can get uh, Grambles here. So if we run into one, I'll definitely try to catch it so we can trade for the Shellos. Furfru. You can find them like all over. Three Wakon berries. Nice. Damn it. Also known as the move department store. I say that Pokemon can only remember four moves at the same time. Also known as the move department store? What? You've got a Gramble. Even with the Intimidate, we're doing splintered stone shards. That's basically what Stealth Rock is, though. <laughs> Whoa! Dude, that is an awesome animation! And you got- you've got to be joking. And the para, that's stupid. What? That's so cool! Okay, good, he actually hit the second Stone Edge. You didn't need the crit, but I push it anyway, my dude. Alright, I actually a crit on the- the Z-move would have killed the Gramble, but that is such dope animation! Get t bulled into oblivion, BITCH! Sharpedo's terrible defenses and pretty bad HP, from what I remember. It's just kind of a mediocre Pokemon without a speed boost. So, I also need something that can learn ground-type moves. You know, I probably should have just stayed in with... What's his name? With Paralyzed Axe? Alright, Hidden Power Psychic should take out the Ampharos. Indeed it does. Good job, buddy. Thanks for the crit. Hidden power psychic? No, psychic. Sweet. And I'm not even joking about this. Lopany will be the only po is the only Pokemon on this team that I will not swap out. Legitimately, I want to use this Lopany throughout the entire series. I'm and I'm le legitimately gonna make a special Lopany, which will be absolutely terrible, but it'll be so fun to use because it's so out of the out of the blue. Because it's uh, got such a great move pool, but for oh, man, tiss! We're gonna bury him. We're gonna find a big one. All right, six to deal, but endurance and so that only pause. You have to battle me. Yeah, I'll beat all the trainers at some point. I gotta go up again. Like I'm really getting to a point where I want to turn on the XP share. But then Decidueye would get too overleveled, and so would P well, no, Pikachu wouldn't, because it's mine. Um, I don't have the other Pikachu anymore, but... Yeah, Decidueye would get way overleveled, and that'd be the issue. Pokemon and Trainers feeling stacked together. Try receiving the Unleashed Sea Power. I don't know if Lycanroc leveled up. I should have paid attention to who was in front. You have a Tox Effects, from what I remember. Alright, this time you have a Garbodor. You've like, cause I remember this was the random Pokemon, random person that had like the Poisonium Z, wasn't it? The Toxapex with the Poisonium Z. God damn it! Okay, your speed rose sharply. I don't even know if you'll still outspeed me though. With the minus two defense, Crunch might or a minus one. You do outspeed me. Okay, well, at least you use Gunk Shot, not something... Something else. Or something that could... It doesn't have that high of a chance, doesn't it? it it's like... Thank you for the crit, my dude. I don't know if you needed it, but thank you for crit nonetheless. Said Toxapex. I got... <laughs> I got paralyzed. And that, I think, made it not use a Z move. Because she did have Poisonium Z. 
Because I don't remember if it was the, uh, the Wonder Redlock, or if it was just, uh, in, what do you call it? Uh, if it was in my actual original playthrough that I didn't understand why I have Poisonium Z, because we hadn't even seen it yet. We hadn't seen it from an actual trainer. Buginium Z, I suppose we hadn't as well. And Flying Indium Z, we actually got told of the animation by that bird lady that's in the Elite Four. Come on. All right, I made it through the grass. What's this? A Dusk Stone. Very nice. Up, 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 up. Can I avoid him? Nope. I walked right in front of him. I don't understand why. I would have to walk behind him to avoid him. I need a better move than Fire Fang, for real, though. I might have to compare its physical and special stats, because I may end up giving it... I was going to say Fire Blast, but I don't want Fire Blast. I also don't want Stone Edge, or Lichen Rock, for a Rock Slide, so I can have a, a somewhat reliable Rock-type move. I mean, it'd have to be Brick Break. Bubbles is also kind of on the, the, the chopping block, too. I'd be willing to drop Bubbles, probably out of everyone the most. I would... I mean... I don't really still I still don't like Incineroar really um I mean Primarina is definitely my favorite out of the entirety of the squad and if you want me to bring a Primarina in and then we have all three starters let me know for sure and I will do so because I would be just fine with doing that <laughs> oh, hello Mudsdale well, it's good to see you again you look to be in fine form <laughs> No, Pokemon trainers do amaze me. Whatever, I don't care. Shush. You're oh, been a while, lady, and brought lady along too. It's good to see you, Hapu. You look different, like you're ready to go all out or something. Thank you for this good need to do my Z-powered form. Oh, do your best, and no one call you Lily Livered. I don't even think Lily understands what that means. I'm so happy. Do you know where you can find the Kahuna? The Kahuna? I don't want to have one here on Pony. What? Now what do we do? Not be distressed. I wouldn't see I know nothing of this. Alright, let's proceed to the ruins. You stick with me, you two. <laughs> yep. I'll meet you there. Ugh. And then her... Hapu's grandma is gonna say Hapu made some friends. And then give us the Machamp. I remember where I wanted to go. I wanted to go to Lush Jungle. I don't even know what she said. But that's okay. I found a sticker. There are just some parts of the story that is literally the, the exact same, and I have no interest in uh, rereading it because. <laughs> Must is looking at you intently. What's up? You the one found the photo of the staff, and let me know what you're finding about it. Did you see Mudsdale? Two of us in the photo. Oh, that was your Mudsdale. Damn, that Mudsdale's old. Wow. Because <laughs> you're Hapu's grandmother. This brings back memories. Mudsdale, calm down! It must be frustrating to keep losing. I know it makes you furious. Always be with you. Always be together. Strain hard do our best to be Kahuna's grand trial. Mudsdale and I have been together since then before we knew Hapu came along. The Hapu means friends with other Mudsdale. That other Mudsdale there. Oh, there's two of them. Heart scale. Thanks. I miss Toothpick. I really do. Okay, what is this item on here? It's a shiny stone. Alright. Is there something in here? Okay, I don't know why that's there then. There's still that dude peering through the... The hole in the wall. <laughs> it took me forever to find a Pokemon here, so it better not be something absolutely... F it took me like ten attempts to get a stupid Magikarp. Alright, I get a big, big pearl as soon as I... There's gotta be something over there. Why is there a... There's obviously a... A thing to break rocks for a reason. Uh, apparently not. Okay, what is this gonna be? A whalmer. You keep... Me you kept messing me up while surfing. Oh, Lily, I've never seen this Pokemon. Okay, um... I'm sorry about that. 
The game will let me freaking run away from a stupid Whelmer. Like, come on, man. Something I may end up doing is actually... Uh... Oops. Come on. Watch, it's gonna be another Whelmer that won't let me escape. What is... Oh, alright. I Is there another Stardust? It is. Okay. So is this just, a, like, a way to avoid everybody? I actually didn't want to avoid trainers, but... Instead of a fish Pokemon, a trainer appeared. Well, I mean, you're on a beach. Dragulge! A drag algae. That's pretty neat. That did surprisingly much. Was that a crit? No, it wasn't. Oh, well, that's gonna hurt, and Java will probably go. Nope, Java hung in there. Very nice. Because, I mean, drag, drag algae is really powerful. Ad with adaptability, it's absurd. And he got the crit this time. Good job, Java. No, she got the crit. Excuse me. Flamethrower. That could be interesting. But, you just don't really have the stats for it. I might just do a little bit of calcing and see how much a Fire Fang would do. Yeah, Fire Fang still does more, so. <sighs> yep. No, I don't want to learn it. Uh, keep old moves. Now the good thing is we only have a co we only have like a trainer or two more on this route, and then we gotta go talk to uh, Hapu and Lily in there, and then Hapu gets chosen as the the Kahuna, and then we'll we're gonna go battle her later because this is where Scald is. You leave the best move in the game this far. I don't remember where. What was even in place of it? Charge Beam? Charge... I think Frost Breath was here, actually. Hey, a Gramble, I need that. I meant to use a Quick Ball, but I was thinking, alright, I can return on it and do some damage. Well, I did way too much. I don't even have really anyone good to <laughs> fight Gramble. That's crazy. Okay, so it shouldn't actually have uh, Crunch. So I'm gonna swap into... It doesn't actually get Crunch at all by level up. Wow. Oh, it does, by at 59. Thanks, Gramble. Found another Gramble. Critical Capture actually caught it this time. Nice! Wow. I was literally... I'm. This isn't me just trying to ham it up, but legitimately I was thinking, what if this had an adamant nature? I really wonder if it's good. Because that could be awesome to have a decent gramble. Does this area seem like a power spot to you? What does that even mean? Oh my gosh, I still love a, a normal sand shoe. It's so cute. That sand shoe did decent damage, Judy. That's pretty good. Next up is a Persian. It should be normal Persian. And I feel like I can stay in on it. Yeah, take that. You're gonna go for taunt. Ha! <laughs> Jokes on you, I don't have a single non-attacking move in my on this Pokemon. And goodbye Persian. Alright, let's just go down here to the Ruins of Hope and go talk to all these people. And we may end up encountering the point what which made me hate Lily. The ruins of hope. What is this place? The air feels so oppressive. But if we go in there, maybe never return to normal. People believe the guardian deity of these ruins type of thing can wash any impurities of mystic water. You think that'll work? Oh, honestly, I'm gonna make sure Nebby gets right back to normal just to show you. Like, I don't know, that's... I don't really understand the reason that she's so upset by that. I legitimately asked, do you think that'll work? So that's what made me hate her. So, anyway, I don't care. I'm glad they kept that in, though, so I could point out why I hate her. <laughs> I miss my boy, Toothpick. I never went to the Lost Jungle to get Energy Ball. The books say they're all capricious. The characters don't know what's in this. You may explain the kind of students as an evokes response from Nebby.
I give my thanks for your great blessing. As Kuna, I'll do my best for the people. And the Pokemon of Alola. Oh, you two are watching? Kuna is chosen by Pokemon Watch the Persecret Guardians. He's chosen by the people living on the island. Guard watch over. Let me tell you, pretty new, eh? Came of Alola? There must be something there. How are you giving a spot concern with a top move and a stranger to our shores? My grandfather was also chosen for this honor, honor being an island's kahuna. He died suddenly some years back when we left with our kahuna and pony. I tried to find his footsteps, I was not chosen by Tampu, so I my own sort of island challenge. Trying to grow stronger, blah 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 blah. And now I'm the kahuna and I'm gonna have to go beat you. The kahuna she wished. Please tell me all about the legendary Pokemon. So you wanna know about Lunala, who we pay tribute to at the altar of the moon? Let's go up to my mother, she disappeared in some far off world. And a fearsome creature lives in that world, a, a Pokemon called Necrozma. That's why I want to ask the legendary Pokemon for its help. The legendary Pokemon is only the only one that can go back and forth between worlds. Where up a beast was not, eh? Reckon that must be some kind of world you find at the other end of those holes that open up in the sky. There's my grandfather once described. So, a lily knows. Not a lily, a lily. <laughs> lily knows that uh, only the legendaries can pass between the worlds. But she hasn't made the connection yet that. Cosmog was able to open the the was able to transport Lucimede and Guzma into the other world. So she hasn't put two and two together. Alright, I'll tell you what I know. That's fine. I don't care. Oh thank you, Hapu. What I know is not much. Is share my own healer to Pokemon the altar legendary flutes? We have both of them. Or we have the sun flute. That's the food to use the other ones on Exeggutor and I don't know blah 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 blah. I don't care. Yep. I'll see you guys later. Let's fight, dude. I'm gonna go get that sticker. Red train discovered. I must immediately make contact. How do you want healing? Damn it. I didn't heal my team up. I don't know if that'll kill Judy. It won't. And it didn't paralyze her either. That's good. I don't know what I just did. Okay. Uh, what do I want to go into? Take on the Turtonator. Shed Shell. Okay. Shell Smash. Okay, since your defense fell. Let's see if Bulldoze will knock you out. You know, I'd be really surprised if it, if, uh, Java still outsped it. Okay, now you're at plus one. Only at plus one. So let's see if I outspeed you from there. Nope. Alright, well that's gonna hurt. That'll probably actually take Java out. And it never survives on one HP either. I hate that. I know you won't outspeed Judy, so I'm just gonna freaking take you out with a- I didn't want to even use Quick Attack, so if it doesn't kill, I'm mad. Okay, we're good. Bye, Turtonator. Next up is a Drompa. Alright. Alright, Splintered Storm Shards, or whatever it is. I obliterated it. I didn't miss it this time. I knew there was one on the inside of one of these walls that I had seen, I just couldn't remember where it was. So I'm gonna do a double take, actually. Make sure I didn't miss any stickers, because I could have 90, and I might be able to get another totem, whatever the next totem would give us. What would it be? That's actually a really good question. They might actually do Lorantis this time, because there hasn't been another totem Pokemon since Mimikyu. And I already got the Mimikyu. Oh, I have to... whatever. They're gonna talk, I don't even care. I know. Hapu's gonna thank you. Yes, with friends do friends. Amazing trainer considers me a friend. I'm so glad I got to meet you. <laughs> Mina will. Yeah, it's Mina taking us this time. That's really cool. Are they actually. I think they. I don't know if they intend to do that because they basically just replaced uh, the veterans' lines with Mina's. But I kind of like the voice that it gave Mina. I just feel like it fits her really well. She's kind of just stoned. Whoa. Oh, uh, there we go. Number 90. There's Huntails on the boat. I like that. Okay. Nothing from Professor Oak. Uh, if she actually has a trial, I wonder if she has a totem. Or if her totem is going to end up being the dragon. Oh, there's another one here. Uh, because obviously there's a dragon trial. Because he had to fight Hakama... Uh, Whatever the little baby one is, Sakama-o and then Kama-o. 
This is Mina's house. Once I doubt of ours, yep. When she snow Stumble a picture of drawn of it, this little fellow chewed that drawing of shreds in its delight. Mi Mina misunderstood and thought Stumble torn it up because it was bad. Aw. Snubble's so damn cute. It's kind of funny how Ilama literally went into someone's house and put a sticker on the wall. Alright, where well, I think that's going to be where I'm going to be ending this episode. So, really if you enjoyed it, like, in the next episode, we'll be fighting Hapu, I, I think, as well as going to Executor Isle and figuring all that out. I don't know what I want to do about the Gramble, though, because <laughs> I went and caught it and it ended up being, it might be decent, so I might check, but... We'll see. I could just always breed off an adamant snubble, because you never know. Anyways, thanks so much for watching. Really, it was your Dix Pitch Mission Scott, and I will talk to you all later.